Hello everyone, I'm Stefan. In this tutorial, we're going to learn how we drive the formula of, uh, of a sphere from the scratch. If you don't check my previous video, we drive the formula of the volume of a cone. So this time we're, we're doing the, 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 the formula of a sphere. And the idea how we're, what we're going to do, we're going to select a small cylinder that has the the radius r and the thickness dx small tiny thickness so we know what is the the volume and then we sum them all by integrating from zero to r this is the idea first of all we know that uh, the volume of this small cylinder is just the area here complete area multiply and the height and this in this case here is the thickness and the height is just dx so let's do that find the volume of the small cylinder we know that dv is just pi r squared dx so this is the formula and let's analyze this r if we take this here this uh, right triangle has a 90 degree here so this r here if we go to Pythagoras theorem we have this here here is just it's just r of the circle complete circle so what is going to be this this r here is the r we know that r is the is the the radius of the circle any anywhere you take it is this one here it will be all these are r's so what is going to be is just x squared plus r square if you see this is the the right triangle so this one here hypotenuse is just this one here squared plus this one here squared this is squared this is just this one plus this one squared so this is the one we have here is here therefore r squared is just this is square here is just r squared minus x squared therefore dv is going to be just pi times r squared minus x squared dx so this is this, uh, the the for, uh, the the formula of this tiny volume of this cylinder here so what we're going to do we're going to drive the uh, uh, integrate this uh, this this uh, this formula here to have complete v we can call it v small because this is v just a half of this uh, the the circle the cylinder is going to be is just the uh, integ integ uh, integration from zero to r from here to this point here at this distance we can we are going to choose all these chunks here small cylinder so we, we, are, we are going to integrate from zero to r of what of this one here so what is going to be is just pi r square minus x square dx so what we're going to have this pi here is just constant we can take it outside and we will have pi from 0 to r of r squared minus x squared dx so therefore v is just pi times r squared x minus 1 over 3 x to the third 
from 0 to R. So what we did here, we just uh, integrate this by itself. If we have a constant A and you want to integrate it, A is just AX. is a polynomial. And we have, for example, X to the, ter uh, X to the power A is just 1 over A plus 1, X to the A plus 1. We add 1 here and we divide by 3 plus 1 in that case but if we have the uh, we have it here squared it will be just x to the third x to the 2 plus 1 and divide it by 2 plus 1 so what we're going to get here just going to be pi times uh, r to the third minus 1 over 3 r to the third. What we do when we have this situation, we substitute r in x and then minus, but uh, when we have zero, we give us just zero. So it's going to be just like that. Just refreshing if you don't remember the integration. So what we're going to have is just pi times three r to the third minus r to the third over 3. We will have pi 2 over 3 r to the third, but this is just half of the sphere, therefore the entire volume is going to be just multiply in 2, and is going to be v is going just to be 2 pi 2 over 3 r to the third and we are going to have 4 over 3 pi r to the third and this is the answer we have here is same answer so this is a very easy way to to find the, the volume of a sphere without memorizing it and this is the answer Hopefully you like this video, please subscribe and share and thank you for watching.